I met the chopper crew as you requested. 0500 was damn early. Where are we heading? You told me nothing. What about the bomb? What about Eck? Eck used an old KGB redoubt as a training camp. That's where she would have taken the bomb. Her camp is located in the ruins of a castle. The castle is perched up on a rocky outcrop about 50 k's from your present position. Access is restricted to cable car only. I can't risk you and the chopper going in close. A shoulder launch SAM could bring you down too easily. Access to the cable car is located in a regular army training fort, located at the base of the mountain. We will drop you some distance away. A weapons cache has been prepared for you. One of Harrison's men left it for you. Collect the weapons cache. Proceed to the training fort. Ride the cable car up to the peak of the mountain. David, I've managed to access building plans for the fort. My man in Moscow came up trumps. The cable car has its own independent power supply. The power supply is off. I've checked. Locate the generator. Well, here we have a very vast landscape for a game in 2000. Doesn't actually look terrible at a distance. Graphically. It's quite impressive, to be fair. Not bad, not bad. Not bad at all. Not too dissimilar to the Seven Days to Die art style in a way. But yeah, anyway. Let's go ahead and encroach on the base. There is one sniper in the tower. He's moved around, so we're just going to continue strolling on up. And we're going to wait for him to appear here. And swiftly take him out. Nice and easy. Just like that. I still remember the animations of soldiers dying from uh, when I played this game as a kid. Very, very distinct animations. Uh, I'm not sure if we're going to go for the Dragonov or not at any point. Don't know if there's any alarms to worry about. Yeah, there are. The way he starts running indicates that he's going for an alarm. At least, I assume so. Ooh, hello. Oh, Jesus. Oh, good lord, hello. Well, if they had an alarm, they've activated it. At least I would assume so. Chewing through the MP5 ammo. Good, nice. Sweet Prince. Well, that's pretty much this base secure, apart from a few geezers up in that building. Actually didn't see him. Oh, hello. Accuracy is so poor. Is he dead? Yeah. There's a couple of soldiers, I think. Looks like they've been taken care of as well. Yep, we're doing decent. Not for health though. We're doing decently well. Right. Any uh, health? By any chance? I'd appreciate it. Nope, just a random radio. Cool. No. But he's still alive. Oh. Righty then. That should be the base secure now. Why has my webcam done this again? Why have you betrayed me? Oh well, no longer in the Dark Ages. We're back. Oh shit. That's not supposed to go like that. By the way, I should be dead right now. Um, did not know you could get off of your uh, zip line by pressing E again, but it does make sense. That was terrifying. I'm gonna keep my finger firmly away from E from now on. Our guard HQ normally has a lot of guards. Was I? No, I wasn't full health, was I? I completely forgot.
Right, so now it's a complete new day as I failed this mission before several times. Um, for some reason, I just decided to play in a silly manner. Um, it well, really wasn't that difficult to clear this first compound, but the first time I played through this mission, um, I made it seem like it was. Anyway, um, we do have these two geezers to worry about. Uh, I'm just going to go ahead and have the MP5 ready for when we get there. Finally, he dies. Luckily, when they say, hey, you, there's normally about a half second to a second buffer where they don't shoot you. Anyway, I'm gonna, going to approach the mission from here. Don't need to go take care of that guy. He's only got an AK anyway, so it's a waste of ammo. And take this guy out nice and early. Won't alert the base. He's just chilling up there. That soldier's there, so we can take care of him now. Uh, he is nowhere to be seen just yet. Uh, where else are we going to have some minutes? So, got all the guard towers are occupied. Um, we can actually take this geezer out with some AK-47 ammo. Uh, where is he? He's just there. Okay, so we can get to about here before he sees us. Good night, sleep tight. Don't let the bed bugs bite. <clears throat> I've got a really scratchy throat today because it's bloody boiling in the UK. It's currently the 12th of July and we are seeing temperatures of peaking at around 30 degrees Celsius. Now that is not good for anyone in the UK, let me put it lightly. Anyway, do a little bit of parkour, hopefully we don't actually end up dying this time. Uh, security camera. Can I just shoot this and will they know? Sorted. He did. Is there someone in there? No. Sorted. Right, where were we? Taking care of the guys in the guard post. Um, we do have... Uh, watchtowers here. A lot of security cameras. Um, can't remember if these security cameras are looking at each other. But we shall see. Right. Continue progressing on. That security camera is looking where? He's just wandering around up there. Security camera looking over there. No alarm for him to press.
Good night, sleep tight. Right. If my... Yeah. Yeah, see now, the thing is about this game, it doesn't matter where your crosshair is. A lot of the time, there's just a bit of RNG to where your bullets go. Which is, uh... A tad frustrating, but it's a sign of the games of the time. Oh, you can actually disable the uh, webcams. Nice. Rightio. My throat sounds demolished today. This heat is not good for me. I don't know if there's any enemies in here. Don't believe so. We have been through here before once. Yeah, I kind of uh, royally messed up. Oh well, is what it is. Who we got then? One hooligan patrolling ground floor. Line up directly and shoot him. Oh, oh never mind. Bloody hell. Killed him there, destroy that, and then destroy that security camera, please. Thank you. Right, we do have a watch post over here to worry out for. Uh, can kill that guard. Hmm. I'm not sure where you get in this building. I think it's right there, but we'll run around it just in case. We'll see if they run out after me. It appears... Oh. Is it just him? Yeah, just him. Cool. Hey, you! Cable car activated. Now we can head on over and get back to where I got blasted last time by two AI camping with a shotgun. <laughs> yeah, it was not the greatest way to uh, go about things. Right. They haven't activated the base alarm, but I think they had with the way they're charging at me. Um... I don't know if there's a way out of the base here. I don't believe so. And now off we go. I ended up watching a few um, Project IGI videos of speedruns and other stuff like that to see what strats are available in this game. And apparently if you use W and A to run sideways and then jump, that's the fastest way of uh, traversing around the map. So here we are spamming jump, bunny hopping as it were. No health lost so far, that's actually um, quite a nice surprise. The AI is quite easily exploitable in this game, and I think that is why I was able to complete it as a kid. This game is very difficult if you do it the wrong way. As many games can be, but this is extremely unforgiving. And I of course had to figure out the strategies that worked as a kid. Right, uh, what we'll do is we will take him out. Uh, are there any cameras to worry about? Not really. <clears throat> My throat is so buggered. There are some soldiers in there. They're going to pop out eventually, so we will have to take care of them. 
Uh. Uh. Sorted. Right now. Is he spotted by a CCTV camera? No. Hmm. <clears throat> He doesn't care about his uh, friend's dead body there. Not as he. Get back to cover, because they will blast you. Nice bit of you, nice little use of the terrain there to uh, dodge some bullets. That was uh, a lot closer than it should have been. Ooh, was that spaz twelve ammo? No idea. Didn't really say it. Just said ammo. Um, right. We took out the guard and the checkpoint. There is gate access here. We do, however, have to worry about. Cameras there. Should be some guards in here with shotguns ready to blast me into next week. Because that's how I died last time. Not too fun. Alright, not here. About here, I reckon. I reckon it was. Or not. Nope. Literally no one, apparently. We can go ahead and disable the cameras here then. Allowing us to shoot them. So then we can uh, take care of this geezer. Oh, fuck. Whew. Well, that's pretty much mission complete as far as I remember. Oh. We do a little bit of breaking and entering it appears. Use the console to activate the cable car. Well. And that is the mission. No health lost. It was actually quite an easy playthrough. So, yeah, here we are. No idea how I struggled with this mission before, but I suppose when, you, when you're when tired, you don't approach things correctly. So, here we are. Anyway, on to the next one.